Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Pepsi CEO made sickening statement about Trump. Consumers calling for immediate boycott. Even Barack Obama has managed somehow to be cordial and fairly gracious to President Donald Trump, but not Pepsi CEO and chairperson Indra Nooyi. She chose instead to be combative and caustic. She launched multiple attacks on Donald Trump, stating, "How dare you talk about women that way?" She basically sees Trump as the end of society. Pepsi might want to consider replacing this shrew before their stock takes a fatal dive. Nui, who claims employees broke into tears over Trump winning the White House, color me very skeptical over that claim, assured them it was not the end of the world. How big of her? The first thing that we all have to do is to assure everyone living in the United States that you are safe, she said Thursday, reported CNBC. Nothing has changed as a result of this election. The process of democracy has happened. We just have to let life go on. Yes, life will go on. But things have indeed changed, don't kid yourself. From the Conservative Tribune While Barack Obama, defeated 2016 Democrat presidential nominee Hillary Clinton and President-elect Donald Trump have all called for unity, PepsiCo CEO and chairperson Indra Nooyi has instead chosen to stir the pot. She did so Thursday at the New York Times Deal Book Conference in Manhattan by issuing unnecessary attacks on her future president. How dare you talk about women that way? She exclaimed in a statement at the conference, referencing comments Trump made while on the campaign trail and in an old Access Hollywood tape leaked last month. If we don't nip this in the bud, it is going to be a lethal force in society, she added, as reported by Forbes. Was such caustic criticism really necessary? Even Barack Obama had reportedly promised Wednesday to root for Trump and essentially let bygones be bygones, according to the New York Times. Everybody is sad when their side loses an election, he declared. But the day after, we have to remember that we're actually all on one team. This is an intramural scrimmage. This woman is holding a grudge and throwing a hissy fit. It's just classless and juvenile. I don't know what else I would expect from a rabid Hillary Clinton supporter. A lot of what should have been said during the election, I don't think was said. We let the politics trump the issues, pardon the pun. The real issues that are facing the country, we never talked about. You see, that's exactly backwards. We did talk about issues that were important to mainstream Americans, you just didn't listen or care. That's the problem. You are so wrapped up in insane subjects such as gender, birth control and climate change, you've lost total touch with what is important to most people out there. Like jobs and being able to put food on the table. Trump won because he listened and he took Americans seriously. Clinton lost because she has no idea how to relate to a real human being anymore. It's sad that this sea hag is using the Pepsi brand as a leftist political podium. The joy of Pepsi Cola isn't so joyful these days. Me, I prefer Coke. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.